Hey, what's up guys? We're going to be talking about how to do uh, subscription products or two payments or three payments, whatever it is. If you have more than one payment and you're doing this inside of uh, ClickFunnels, this is how you're going to do it. So let's go beyond the funnel. Let's take a quick look at what happens here. Uh, we are inside of my Stripe account, actually, so or uh, one of my test accounts. I use this when I'm using uh, when I'm showing tutorial. Uh, but what I want you guys to see is, let's say you have a subscription product. Let's say for the sake of argument, that is ninety-seven dollars a month. Um, so you, you'll notice in here, I'm in Stripe. If you go to subscriptions here, and then you go to plans. So you'll have subscriptions and you'll have plans. This is where you need to go. So go to subscriptions, go to plans. This is where we're going to put any and all subscriptions that we ever plan on offering to our customers. All right. So uh, chances are you're not going to have all these. These, like I said, have all been uh, test data. You'll probably have one or two. If you have payment plans for a couple different products, they will also go here like this one. Uh, this product uh, shows as a two pay option. Um, so they would make uh, two payments of 2000 Now, that is partially set up here and partially set up in ClickFunnels. So let me show you how that works. Let's, we're going to start brand new. We're going to create a new plan. So come up here and click New. Go to the ID. Uh, I'll be honest, I make up random IDs. Um, you can make this whatever you want, but just remember, it needs to be the same thing in the test data. There is a test area and there is a live area. So make sure that you're doing this in the live area. And then once you make up that ID, it really doesn't matter for anything ever. But just make sure that it's unique and then copy it. Just, uh, I'm on a Mac. I'm Command C. Okay, so let's call this new product to pay. All right, so, or we'll, we'll make this one three pay. So let's say it's a three payment uh, deal, and we're going to come down here. It's going to be um, three pay, so we're going to do that, and we're going to come down here, and we're going to make a three payments of, we'll say, $47, $67, $67. So just put that. These are monthly payments. You can make them yearly. You can make them daily. You can make them we weekly, or you can make it custom. Just to keep things easy, we're going to make it monthly with no trial periods, and we're going to, we'll just say, Works. that's the name of my company in case you guys are wondering and then when you're done you just hit uh, create plan now here's uh, what's what's gonna make it fun we're also going to go to the test data and we're going to hit new and we're going to do this again in case you wondered where that was down here there's a little toggle switch it says view test data we're gonna go here and make sure it says test click new and then we're going to paste that same ID right back in there. We're going to call it my new product three pay. Okay. We're not setting up the actual three payments inside of Stripe. That part is set up inside of ClickFunnels. Um, if you're in a different country, make sure you set this to something besides USD, um, unless you just want to make US dollars. Not sure how that works, but um, I'm in America. We're going to charge USD, and that is $67 monthly, no trial, and again, funnel works okay so this is a test plan so when we go to test this inside of click funnels um, it will use this plan but this is unique it's the same in the live version as it is in the test area so let's create that plan all right now we have that in here twice uh, my new product three pay and in the live my new product three pay now we're going to make a new one this one is going to be the actual uh, monthly into perpetuity thing until perpetuity until they cancel. So uh, let's say it's ninety seven dollars to keep that uh, easy. I don't know I already said that. So we're gonna say new. We're gonna make up a random string. We're gonna call it uh, my new continuity program. Okay, and it's ninety seven dollars monthly, no trial, and the statement is. Uh, still funnel works. You can put whatever you want. This, by the way, is what shows up on the credit card. And so don't get too too carried away with it. If you're in some uh, strange uh, some strange company where you don't want it to be obvious what it is that you do, just make sure that you get creative with that part, okay? 
So we're going to do the same thing again in the test data, but ooh, you know what we forgot to do, my new continuity program. What do we need? We need this. We need that ID. So we're going to copy that out. We're going to go into test data. We're going to go to new. We're going to copy that ID in here. My new continuity program. Said it was $97 in US monies and phone works. Okay, create a plan. And that's it. That's all we have to do here in Stripe. Okay, you don't have a lot of people, and I've had clients, and the reason that I'm making this video is because I realized it might be an issue. A lot of people come down here to products and they start adding products to this, thinking this is where they need to go to make one off payments. Any one time payment uh, programs or products that you offer will not go here, they will go into ClickFunnels. If you're using anything besides ClickFunnels, it might be different. You might have to add that product here and uh, you know set it up differently with a different system. But specifically, we are talking about how to set up continuity or multi-pay uh, program with ClickFunnels, uh, as, with Stripe as an integration. So let's go over to our ClickFunnels account and we are going to create a new order page. All right, so this is the new funnel builder. In case you haven't seen it, um, I am not going to use it today. Um, I'll use it. I've used it in plenty of other videos, but it won't be in this one. Uh, classic funnel builder. I'm going to use that because it allows me to create a custom funnel. All right, we're going to use it. We're going to call it professional. Uh, we're going to call it professional order form funnel. All right, and then we'll. I'm going to. You know, I might put this one in the marketplace at some point. So. I'm actually going to put this in the marketplace group and build funnel. So uh, let's go to, if you guys aren't familiar, um, you can select from a bunch of different templates. Now I've created some templates, so we're going to go to sales order form. You could create this. I, I would add this funnel or this order page to uh, an existing funnel if you have one, or you can put an opt-in page, a sales page, and then an opt-in page. You can put upsells. The only one that I'm worried about right now, because for the sake of what we're doing, is the order form page. And um, I am going to do, I'm going to use this one, I think. Um, select this template. Okay, so this is the page that we're going to build, and we're going to show you what the page itself looks like, although we're not actually going to end up using it. So basically, it's going to take the name, email, phone number. You can create you know, whatever you want up here. I call it your enrollment package awaits. Uh, you can put whatever you want here as the subhead. Um, down here, you can put whatever you want, you know, all, all the information about what your order is. Or if you just want to make up your own order page, the system works the same. You don't have to use this one at all. Um, so I'm just putting this here as an example. And um, what I'm showing you will work with any order page, all right? Um, I am going to give you guys a copy of this, this page uh, at, at no charge. There's going to be a link right below in the description if you're on YouTube. And you guys will be able to click on that migrate this right on into your ClickFunnels account. If you don't have ClickFunnels, um, it'll prompt you for a 14-day free trial. If you uh, want to do it that way, you can, or I'll leave a link so you can just go straight into the trial and, uh, and give ClickFunnels a try. As a funnel builder, this is the only program that I use. All right, so whatever order page you have, let's say this is it. There's a products tab. Come over here to products, okay? And we're going to add a product down here in the corner. Uh, hopefully this works. We're going to call this one. What do we call the uh, the first one? So we have two options for these people. We can give them a, a single pay, a three pay, and a subscription. And um, so that, that's what we're going to give them. We're going to give them three options. So there's always the uh, one pay. We'll call it my new product. One pay. Not using Infusionsoft. We're using Stripe. And it'll be a one-time payment of $290, uh, we'll say $197. Come down here, $197. We'll put the dollar sign in on this one. Um, and then Funnelworks, 
that'll be again what goes in the credit card statement this is a one-time this is not the subscription okay so this is where you would put a one-time sale create that product bam that's where it's going to show up we want to do the three pay option now okay so my new product three pay all right now what we're going to do before we fill anything else out we're going to come uh where to go they changed things didn't they oh that's so cute let's see wait no they didn't let's go to stripe all right so you have to click on stripe and then it, it pulls this up <laughs> all right so come down here and go to subscription and it actually takes the amount in the amount of currency out so i think this only works with uh, USD or works with whatever is set up inside of Stripe. In fact, it tells you that this product is managed inside of the Stripe account. So this is where you're going to come and put um, $67, three pay. That way they can see, okay, it's $67 three times, whatever. We're going to say subscription. We're going to say product description, funnel works. That's the credit card. And then down here, it is going to go into, it is actually linked to your Stripe account. This was not a video on how to integrate with your Stripe account. This assumes that you've already done that integration. But it also has all those programs that we just put in here. You see that? So there's My New Product 3Pay and the Continuity Program. We're going to select uh, My New Product 3Pay because that's the product we're setting up. Now here's what where it can get a little bit tricky. So this is the 3Pay. Number of payment plans. We're going to put 3 because this is the 3Pay. All right. Now we're going to click on create product. I'm going to show you something different uh, when we build in the, the continuity pro. And guys, I'm just showing you the examples here. If you have uh, no single or three pay payments and you're only selling a continuity program, then uh, don't put these one pays and three pays in here. Just put the continuity program in, all right? <laughs> so we're going to click on add product again. And we're going to say, we're going to add in that continuity, my continuity, my continuity program. Okay. And that goes into perpetuity, uh, or as you'll see, 999 payments. We're going to go to Stripe again. We're going to say subscription. And then we're going to come up here. We're going to say, uh, I think we, I think we're using $97 a month for this one. Make sure you do subscription. Um, do not click on the bump if it if it gives you the option. We're not clicking on bump. Okay, product description again, funnel works, Stripe plan. Okay, this is where it's going to look into your Stripe account. It says, hey, this is what plans you have. Remember when we filled that stuff out here in the uh, subscriptions area and then plans? This is where it's getting that information from. If you don't put this stuff here and you put it under products it's not going to show up so you have to put it under subscriptions under plans all right so let's look at that again we're going to do my new continuity program uh, right here and then where it says number of payment plans we are going to say 999 because it will not go at more than 999 and uh, that's actually many many years most of your people will not stay that long in a continuity program anyway so um, they will have to get a hold of you to cancel uh, payments. Um, they cannot cancel these payments on their own unless they challenge it at the bank with their credit card. And if that's the case, that means that you probably didn't take care of them. Hopefully you do because you're an awesome entrepreneur and an awesome business owner. So that was it. Uh, we're going to come down here and click on create product. Now we have all three products uh, on one order page. Uh, but just for the fun of it here, we're actually going to go over here to the page we're going to view this page and down here at the bottom it'll actually show you all three products so you got your one pay your three pay or your continuity program and when you make that that uh, charge when they go through here and put all their information in put their credit card in and click on complete my order they will be charged starting immediately $97 a month or uh, three payments of uh, 67 or one-time product if they buy that then that's 197 so uh, guys that's it that's how it works 
Um, there's really nothing else to it. If you guys want this order form page right here, I'm going to leave a link down below. You guys can download this funnel, migrate it right into your ClickFunnels account. Uh, that's my gift to you. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up, thumbs down. If you want more tutorials like this, uh, subscribe to the channel, hit the little bell up in the corner, and you'll get notified when we create new videos. We're trying our best to make uh, lots of new videos per week so that you guys uh, understand funnels and click funnels and how to how to do all this fun marketing stuff like we're doing. I, I really enjoy this stuff and I uh, can't wait to see you guys in the next video. I'll talk to you guys next time. Thanks.